This right here is the Orwell Mini PC. Now, when you first look at it, you will not be able to tell that this thing is a PC because all the USB ports are hidden. They're hidden underneath these little slots over here. Well, right here is the power button. It's underneath the Orwell logo. You move it around, and right here is your USB-C port. You got two of them. You got one right here, and then one right here. It comes with a USB adapter, a USB-C to a regular USB, so you can hook up your thumb drives your mouse, your keyboard, anything like that. If you, but if you want to avoid clutter, you can obviously use a Bluetooth keyboard or mouse, which is what I'm going to be using. So let's go ahead and close these. So you got one more slot to open up, and that is a micro HDMI port. And it comes with all these cables, so right out of the box, you should be able to go. Before I boot this up, it's worth noting that it does come with a power brick. It's a relatively small power brick compared to other laptops. And it, it powers it up using one of the USB-C ports, and yeah, it won't get in the way at all. So let's go ahead and do this. All right, now the Orwell mini PC is hooked up to my monitor. It has power and you might notice this OLED screen and that it's there for a very special reason. That is because it works with this NFC key. Now, let's see what happens when I try and power it on. I push the power button and you see right there it says present key. Now, if anyone else tries to do this, they can't. They don't know what key to press. They need this NFC key right here and this is the key to unlock it. So to unlock it, you place it on top of the Orwell Mini PC and it should unlock. 